Hello again, everybody. Welcome to a new edition of Kane Sports Inside the Lions. Today, we're going to take a look at cornerback Deani Hill, a new arrival from Marshall who figures to factor in a major way in Miami's pass defense this season. Now, we don't have to tell you that the defensive backfield has been identified as maybe the biggest area of weakness on this Miami team, on this Miami defense. But Hill promises to do his part to change that. And he thinks that this group will surprise people uh, this season. Um, Hill had a big advantage coming into the program. He played at Marshall under Lance Guidry, so he knows the Lance Guidry defense. He's been coached by Chavez Jackson. So uh, a lot of familiarity there and clearly a comfort level or Deani Hill would not be in this Miami program as we speak. So we had a chance to sit down with Hill and uh, hope you enjoy this look at how he uh, sees his role in the Miami defense this year and what he thinks the prospects are for the unit as it embarks on the season. Enjoy. Talk a little bit about how the adjustment to Miami has gone for you and uh, what your outlook is for uh, the season. Um, the objective is to, you know, continue to, to evolve each and every day. Um, since I got here, you know, I have been like very welcome here. Um, I feel like my first two weeks, it's like I was already a part of the program. Um, it wasn't too much adjustment but like with the playing calls and you know stuff like that because I was already familiar with the system. So it was just about coming out here and executing, um, you know, being the best I can be each and every day. And I felt like with me coming out here and, you know, being hot, you know, the first the first um, couple weeks of practicing, I just felt like that gave the team like the um, the comfort they need with me to be a part of the system. So I just felt like coming in, I was like very welcome. and. Um, Continuing to be me and being great. That's got to be huge, though. Yes, sir. Coming to a new place and knowing what to do <laughs> right. for the most part. You right. know, I'm sure Coach Gidry's put in some wrinkles mm -hmm. uh, since uh, you last saw him. But, I mean, it, it just like having a pretty good understanding right. of what to do has to be huge. Right. And um, the best part about um, the coaches here, like, all around, is, like, nothing is given. Everything is earned. So, like, when it comes to, like, like, like favoritism and stuff like that, it's not none of that. You know, the um, – we have a saying saying like the best the best man will play you know so um count coming up um we just gonna focus on count um on the defensive side and continue to improve and get um more comfortable with playing with each other boss <laughs> we're playing and um just look forward to having a good camp and get ready for the season you know people talk about the family environment at miami every recruit that comes through here mentions it the guys here mentioned it um Coming into a situation like that has to make it easier also. Right. Uh, you feel welcome. You feel, you feel, feel like welcome. home already. Yeah. Yeah. Um, how much did that mean to you? It means a lot because, like, um, at my old school, Marshall, we was getting a new um, cornerback coach, new play calls, and new everything. So, like, I just felt like, hey, if we're getting a new thing here, I can go somewhere else and, um, you know, be great and be in the same boat that I'm in now, you know. Uh, just like to be able to come to a place where it was close to my home and being back close to like my hometown, um, that means a lot. And you know, having the two coaches, especially Coach Jackson, which was there for, since my freshman year of college, you know, um, I can tell that he's like has not done nothing but approve me. So I just feel like going with him was the, the right thing to do to continue to improve. All right. So when people look at this team, they say. Defensive backs have something to prove. Right. Um, I'm sure you guys have all heard it. And that's the that's the best part. Um, that just keep us on the edge. Um, they just let us know ahead of time that we have something to work for and something to look into. You know, um, I feel like we're having that being out there. Um, just gonna make it more challenging for us. Um, but that also gives us a chance to go out and show our showcase our ability and talent to come across each and every game, you know, taking it one game at a time, but starting off at practice, you know. Um, I feel like as long as we continue to compete at practice, you know, that leading into on the field, on the game, on Saturday nights. So as long as we do what we can, like can and supposed to do here, we'll be good. So what do you see as your role on, on this team? How do you see that shaping up here uh, as you get into the heart of training camp? Um, I say um, taking my knowledge of the game, and, you know, and giving it to each and every one that, you know, because we tend to have like a more younger um, secondary, which means it's going to be like some slacks here and there. But as long as we're all on the same page and communicating, it shouldn't be a problem, you know. So when it comes to my role, I just I say like be available, you know, like, you know, my plan is to 
get more consistent reps this year rather than having six or 700 reps and some are mediocre. So just focusing on the goal, which is the end goal is to be great as a team and you know continue to develop. Are you comfortable inside and outside? Um, yes, but I prefer outside. Right. Um, I don't mind playing inside if we're playing man or something like that, right. yeah. Um, so to, to sum it up, uh, is, is this defensive back group on like a mission to prove it's better than people think? For sure. Yeah. And I just feel like even with that not being on our back, that's like that's like the goal. You know, we want to be the best. And in order for you to be the best, it start at practice. So I just feel like with that being out there that we have a point to prove, it just give us something to showcase and, you know, give us something to go into practice each and every day with an edge on our back to get better. You got a pretty decent receiver group right. to get you guys ready. And, that, and that's, the, right, that's the best part about it. You know, we're going to get um, – one of the best offenses in college football. So, with that being said, if we can if we go out and continue to compete with um these guys. You know, come Saturday we should have a ball there. So I just felt like this coming up season is going to be focusing on practice and you know improving much as we can before the season. All right, Diani, well, we're looking forward to watching it, man, and uh, welcome to South Florida, and we wish you the best this yes, season. Yes, sir, appreciate it.